Life at home, it's magical. I tell you, I live not far from it, but it still doesn't, you know, stop me from taking my breath away when it lights up suddenly and you're, because every night it, it lights up. And then you're just like, oh, that happened again. And you still gasp. And I'm like, I've been here six years. I've been looking at that, like, you know, every day, 20 times a day. And it still takes my breath away. So definitely the Eiffel Tower. Although if I lived opposite the gateway, perhaps I would feel the same way. Oh, look at the rain coming or look at the pigeons going. So I don't know. It's hard. So a Parisian habit is they really do live for leisure. You know, so leisure is literally, it's not roti kapra makan. It's roti kapra makan leisure. Right, that is as important as any of the other tenets of life, and that is um, definitely a French way, not just a Parisian way. And I wish that us Indians, uh, we also saw that we're not just working for ambition and to get ahead in life, but we're also working to for the joys in life. And uh, if your work is not giving it to you, then seek it outside, which a lot of the Parisians live like that. Indian habit that I wish Parisians had is a list this long, okay? But let's start with one that actually uh, kind of was the trigger for the book, um, is the warmth. I wish that the Parisians understood how to open their hearts and welcome uh, people into it and how much it gives you in return. I find um, that the Parisians is friendly and is wonderful and is, you know, as... <clears throat> as much as they like to go out, etc., are not people that you can just call up and go, I'm coming to hang in your sofa and not talk to you. That just doesn't happen. That warmth of uh, I'm going somewhere, you also come, or doesn't matter, I'm going for dinner, you also join in, or uh, families and that kind of thing, it doesn't exist. So there's a lot of formality. There's always greetings and hello and how are you and poli uh, politess. But is it genuine? No, and in India, there will be the, the, the opposite. So we won't have the, we don't go around greeting people. We don't go around saying bonjour or namaste or hello. But if someone needs something, pretty much even a stranger will uh, turn around and help you in India, you know? I'm married to a Frenchman. So, you know, for the sake of my marriage, let's just say, please. 